Hello, welcome to Dinosaur's A to Z, where we stump through the alphabet and explore the extraordinary world of dinosaurs. <laughs> Victoria Edgerton, Eli Lilly and Company, Extraordinary Scientists and Residents at the Children's Museum of Indianapolis, and I'm your guide for dinosaurs A to Z. Today, our featured dinosaur is Hypacrosaurus, for the letter H. Hypacrosaurus belongs to a group of herbivorous dinosaurs called the Hadrosaurs. This is the same group that Edmontosaurus also belongs to. But unlike Edmontosaurus, Hypacrosaurus has a hollow, bony crest on its head. This hollow crest consists of a series of interconnected tubes and chambers. Now, why do you think they had these? Well, we're not really sure. But most paleontologists think they were used to make sounds for communication. The tubes and chambers are reminiscent of brass instruments like tubas or trumpets. <laughs> Birds and crocodilians today are very talkative and use a variety of sounds and calls for communication. So we think dinosaurs probably did the same. And dinosaurs like Hypacrosaurus did it in a very unique way. Another idea is that the crest could have been used for visual displays. Again, modern birds and reptiles use visual displays to protect their territory or to find a mate. This is probably true for dinosaurs, and for Hypacrosaurs, the crest would have been really useful for this. But one thing we know about Hypacrosaurus crests is that they didn't develop until adulthood. A number of Hypacrosaurus nests have been found in Montana and Canada. These nests preserve both unhatched eggs and hatchling Hypacrosaurs. And unlike adult Hypacrosaurs, they don't have crests. Hypacrosaurus eggs are some of the largest dinosaur eggs known. They're spherical and almost eight inches in diameter. That's a little smaller than a soccer ball. Hypacrosaurus took about six months to develop and grow in the egg. That's a pretty long time, much longer than birds today. When they did hatch, they were about two feet long. That's about the length of three and a half brand new pencils. They grew really quickly, much faster than we do. But they could reach their full adult size of about 30 feet in 10 to 12 years. Imagine being 30 feet long and weighing several tons when you're 10. Pretty weird, right? Hypacrosaurus was a really cool dinosaur. You can find some baby Hypacrosaurs in Dinosphere at the Children's Museum of Indianapolis. There are over 40 other dinosaurs that start with the letter H. Which one will be your favorite? 